So first of all, we're going to do a crime effect on this particular unit. And we're going to use Candy 2i. This is all waterway colours. So what I want to do is I'm going to try something a little bit different to start with. I'm going to put down a coat of Hot Rod Sparkle Red, which will go very well with the blood red that I've selected. Okay, so we're not going to need a lot of this. I've reduced it by 10% with high performance reducer. And all I'm doing is basically putting a flake down. So I'm going to let that dry for a second. And this will also seal the edges of the mask because it's been transparent. So this is a 0.5mm setup I've got here because it's hot rod sparkle. You need an open fan pattern, I've got it set at 50 psi. Okay, so what I've done is I've taken some Candy 2O and this is the blood red and I've mixed it with about 20 to 30% of the 4030 mixing additive and then 10% of the high performance reducer. Right, we're just going to go in over the top of these flames now. Just going to build this colour up. Not going to be changing the colour already. Using the air in between just to make sure that it dries it out as we go. Okay. Trying a nice even coat. Remembering how many coats you put on will determine how dark the colour is. You can go as light as you like here, or as dark as you like. Right, time to get the last coat of this on now, so we'll put the last coat of the blood red down. Now, the trick to polycarb, guys, is who you think, oh god, I can see straight through it, I haven't put enough on. Once you put a backing over your paint, the polycarb then will be a nice bright colour representation. So don't just keep piling colour on because that's not the way to do it. You basically just want to put enough down, you know, put it down on a bench even, have a look through, you go, right, okay, I can see that it's covered and it's done, okay? So we're just about done with this now. Nice liberal coat. The liberal coat just blends it all in. Now for this I'm using a hair dryer but it's got a cool setting so we don't want to use heat. We don't want to cure it hard with heat so we'll just go with a nice cool setting and get it dry. So before it gets too, uh, too dry, so we don't want it to dry right up, we're just going to get the mask off of this. It's easier to get it off before the paint goes completely dry. That's how you get nice clean lines. So as you can see I used both the, the tapes we're talking about. Don't waste anything. Use your off off cut bits to mask to mask up areas. And there we go. We're gonna have some. Uh, some candy 2O blood red, some really cool flames going through the Autoway Colors logo. Alright, so now we'll get ready and we'll put down some, uh, some crime.